Greetings. Welcome back to the Man Cave for another episode of Man Cave Meals. Today we're going to fire up the pit barrel cooker once again and cook three racks of pork spare ribs. So uh, let's get started. Okay, first thing we're going to do, I've got three racks of uh, pork spare ribs here that I've already trimmed up and removed the silver skin from. So we're going to we're going to put a good coat of rub on both sides of these guys and then we're going to flip them over and do the same thing. Okay, now that we've got our rub put on here, we're going to let these guys sit for a little while while we get the uh, pit barrel cooker fired up. So I'll meet you at the grill. Okay, I've got my pit barrel cooker charcoal basket filled up here. So we're going to douse this guy with a coat of our starter fluid. And as you remember, this is our preferred way to start this particular cooker. So we're going to soak that charcoal pretty good and then we're going to put it in the uh, cooker and light it up okay we'll just lift this basket right down into the cooker and get our lighter out and we'll light it up in a couple of places and to get this cooker ready we'll leave the lid off for 20 minutes and let that fire get going let our charcoal get ashed over Okay, we've been our 20 minutes. I'm going to drop a couple of chunks of uh, peach wood in here to get a little smoke going for the uh, ribs. And I have hooked each of my racks of ribs here under the second bone. So we're going to put those right on. Let them hang right over the fire. I'm going to hang two on one rack there. And another one over here on this side so we will be back in a couple hours probably going to look at about i don't know we'll come back and check on these in about three hours and see how they're going okay our ribs have been on here for about three hours so we're going to take a quick look see what's going on with some of these guys we'll take our hook tool and lift this rack up and out as you can see we've got some nice pull back here I'm gonna do a little tenderness test with my toothpick uh, these guys aren't quite ready yet gonna be a bit longer so I've got one rack over here that's uh, it's a really a good bit larger rack than the rest and guy's fairly tender but he's not quite there yet so we're gonna let these go uh, another hour or so and come back have a look okay we're about I don't know three hours and 45 minutes or so in and I've pulled these ribs off it's time to glaze these so I'm gonna spread a little bit of my glaze on the back sides of these and then we'll flip them over and hit the other side okay now that we've about got each of these racks glazed on both sides we're gonna hang these back in the pit barrel cooker and let them go for probably I don't know another 30 45 minutes enough to uh, kind of get a good caramelization on this glaze these uh these ribs have a beautiful color and they smell fantastic the peach wood smoke is really like i said in videos past is becoming one of my favorites uh between that and apple wood i'm really settling in on those two they work very well for pork uh the aroma complements the pork nicely so we're probably going to be settling in on that so we're going to hang these guys back in the pit barrel cooker and we'll be back when we're ready to take them off okay folks this is the third rack of ribs I've already taken the two smaller racks off and uh, put them away because this one was a little larger needed a little bit more time to cook so I'm gonna take the hook out of that and let this guy cool for a few minutes and then we'll come back and cut it open okay it's time to cut this rack so I'm gonna get uh, get between a bone here and 
We'll try to. Let's cut it from the back side. And we'll get a nice fat rib right out of the middle of this rack. And have a look at that. That's looking pretty darn good. So let's taste it and see where we are. Mm. Oh man, that's delicious. Really good. Nice bite through texture. Let's have another bite. Mm. Okay, well, that takes care of ribs on the pit barrel cooker. Man, that's good. That's gonna be dinner. So we're gonna do a couple more cooks on the pit barrel cooker here in the future. So stay tuned until next time, Man Cave Meals.